Ever wanted to know the difference between a retention pond versus a detention pond? Did you even know there was a difference? While there may only be a one-letter contrast between the two, they both serve very different purposes in site development. By definition, retention means the continued possession, use, or control of something. So, when we talk about a retention pond, we're really talking about a pond that permanently retains or holds water, even when it's not raining. Typically, retention ponds are used if the goal is for aesthetic or recreational purposes. You can think of it as a small lake that collects stormwater, improves water quality, and provides a natural habitat for the local ecosystem. Just look at how happy these ducks are! So, besides being the place where I spent most of my afternoons in high school, detention works a bit different than its counterpart. Detention ponds are usually dry until heavy rainfall and are designed to temporarily hold stormwater, slowly releasing it at a controlled rate to prevent flooding downstream. So, to keep it simple, retention ponds retain water indefinitely, whereas detention ponds detain water when it storms, and release said water at a calculated rate to prevent deluge. While they may be different, together they protect communities from flooding, both today and for years to come. Want help on your next site? Let's talk.